Hello there, ladies and gentlemen. It is your boy Omni here, and I'm back once again with another review of Farmlandia. Now, the official bot of Farmlandia is now live, and I'm so, so excited to showcase this to all of you. Now, if you're wondering why I'm on a new account, ladies and gentlemen, unfortunately, my YouTube account and my Gmail account got hacked. So, I apologize for anything that is being put up on my channel currently. That is not me, just to clarify. I'm using one of my old accounts uh, with a sort of stock profile on it uh, to be able to continue my YouTube journey. It's a massive setback, and I appreciate every single one of you for, you know, sticking around and, uh, I guess, supporting me through a very tough couple weeks um, on, on my channel and my YouTube adventures. However, ladies and gentlemen, let's not be down today because today we have some very very big news coming out for farmlandia now if you haven't seen i have been posting farmlandia on my old youtube channel which you now obviously can't see um but i have been doing a lot of stuff on that where i've been showcasing the farmlandia like ecosystem and what they're trying to build because it is really really good and really positive and it's definitely something which i expect all of you to go check out because like there's no harm in checking something out you know like you you can check it out not think it's for you and that's perfectly fine however you can at least check it out to see what's good about the ecosystem because there is a heck of a lot of good for farmland here and i'm so so excited to showcase this because in my opinion this is one of the best projects i have ever reviewed and that is that that is like a very weird thing for me to say because i've reviewed like over 100 maybe 200 projects and this is definitely within my top five of projects currently in the ecosystem at the moment so let's get into things today and let's showcase what farmlandia is and what it's going to be doing in the future so first things first this is the farmlandia bot this is where you can earn passive income for essentially investing in a plant or an animal so right now as you can see i'm at the top here so uh hi chief omni finance welcome to our marketplace where you will be able to buy sell and trade goods and be usd within the community now to put, put it in one's perspective ladies and gentlemen so far you can see that i have three trees and you can see that i have zero animals currently so of three trees and bear in mind i got these trees probably about four days ago and you can already see that i've accumulated 9.5 uh, 9 dollars 50 sorry passively um very very quickly and that was is in a four day period ladies and gentlemen and that is within a 130 dollar initial investment which is very very impressive indeed that means that I'm, I'm currently set to make that money back within around 54 days like take that in ladies and gentlemen that is some very very good roi to, if i do say so myself now you may be wondering though sam how is farmlandia able to actually function and how is it able to um you know bring this ecosystem and make sure that it's sustainable now farmlandia is actually a farming sort of company in new zealand and what they're doing is they're they're buying assets like in real life and they're making a sustainable farming ecosystem within new zealand and that is able to bring income into the farmlandia ecosystem and essentially reward people who are investing within the farmlandia bot so right now that is the sustainability factor behind it because you're invest you're investing in a real life company essentially and that is why that this is so so good and beneficial um to definitely have a look at so let's farm let's see let's farm let's have a look and see what farm landing is about so first things first let's have a look at my farm in particular so if i click my farm right here you can see that it pops up on the side now so omni well it should be omni finance but finance farming village um so you can see that i currently have a level one land level i don't have a town hall yet i'm still very base um within this ecosystem however i do plan on growing it and obviously you know as you lot keep going as well we're going to build together that's the beauty of this it's a completely sustainable ecosystem where we all can win we all can grow which is fantastic so the tree sections you can see apple wheat and strawberry so those are the three plants that i have currently now to put in perspective apples are worth ten dollars so an apple tree is worth ten dollars you get 10 apples every single day and it accumulates around i think it's just about two pence uh, or two cents sorry every single apple that you sell so within a day you make around about 
Well, you you make about 20, 20 cents essentially in a day with an apple tree with an initial ten dollar investment. You can do the math there. That is pretty darn good. Uh, wheat. So one wheat is worth twenty dollars, and again you get about four cents for that um, per wheat that you sell, and again you get ten in a day. And a strawberry, it, you can sell one strawberry for 17 cents. The strawberry plant costs $100. However, accumulatively, you are making around $1.70 every single day from that strawberry plant. And I'm sure there is a, a, a good diagram. If I go to the marketplace here, um, I go to sell to market, um, sell my fruits, and we can see what there is. So you can see you can sell your kiwi. Um, which I don't have, but you can see that there's 0 0.0076 uh, dollars. If we cancel that, go to Apple. We see that it's 0.016 cents every single apple that you sell. We go to wheat. You can see it's 0.033 BUSD every single wheat that you have. And again, remember with the plants, it's 10 every single day. Um, sell your mango. So 0.08. So you get 8 cents every single mango that you sell. And obviously the strawberry, which I was telling you about previously, is 17 cents every single strawberry that you sell. And again, those are all 10. Now, obviously, as you upgrade your town hall, you upgrade your land, you'll be able to get a town hall, which you'll be able to sell like animal wool um, from the sheep. And I think I believe every single wool is worth $10. And I believe every single milk is, I believe, $3.20. I think it's something around those lines. Basically, um, a, a chicken is $50, 50 to buy. Um, a cow, I believe, is two hundred or two hundred and fifty dollars to buy, and also um, the sheep is worth five hundred dollars. That is the big boy, and that is the one that obviously generates the most income within a day. So, with a sheep, you're actually earning ten dollars every single day, which is absolutely amazing. Um, but obviously, that there is obviously a big thing you have to pay in at the start, the five hundred dollars. But the fact that you get to basically make that back very, very quickly is a really good thing. And if you do the math, that that will mean that you'll be able to accumulate that money back within about fifty days. So, just to put that in perspective, that is pretty good ROI, if you ask me. And if you're wondering why I'm sweating. It is absolutely boiling in the UK. It is about 30 degrees at the moment. Honestly, it's so, so hot right now. Um, so yeah, if you want to learn how to how you can deposit within this ecosystem, you can simply press make a deposit. Now you can go to crypto exchange. And now as you can see right here, you can do it through BUSD, USDT and BNB. You can also do it through TRX. So you can do it through the Tron network. You can do it through the XRP network and also the Polygon network as well with the Matic. Um, and yeah, that is all for now. However, I do believe that they're going to be adding even more in the near future, maybe like the Arbitrum network and things like that. So that is very exciting stuff. And as well, you can see that you can do it through crypto wallet deposit as well. So the, every Farmlander account will have a single exclusive contract or wallet address. And then as soon as, as soon as you basically process that payment into the deposit scheme, that is when you get credited within the bot. And that's when you can start earning your passive income. It's a very easy thing to do. And it's really, really exciting stuff. And this is definitely something which I highly recommend you all to check out. We go to collect assets. We can see that what I have currently. So I have actually just done a collection about, I would say about an hour ago. Um, but we can see that I have got um, one apple, one wheat, and also one strawberry. They're roughly growing every single every single like item. It seems to be about two hours 30 from what I can tell. Because you have to sort of do 10 divided by 24. Um so that gives you an idea of the sort of time scale um so yeah it's, it's pretty pretty frequently you get credited a fruit and then obviously with that fruit you can then sell it within the the marketplace as i showed previously um but yeah actually let's let's do a quick harvest i'll show you with the the one that i have at the moment so let's let's collect my apples so you can see that uh, so let's be collected one apple so that's equivalent to one cent um collect my wheat um, and that goes into my store room as well. So you can see the town hall stock. And at the base, at the very start, you get to have 500 uh, fruits that you can just sort of store and sort of stock up to then do one big sale if you want to. Um, for me, I just like compounding as I go. Um, you know, I'm pretty active on the old Telegram. So I thought that why not? Let's just let's just keep it moving. Now, now that I've collected my assets, let's go over to the marketplace and let's basically cash in on about the 20 cents I have. So as we can see, my current farm bucks is $9.00. 59 i then go sell to market and let's go sell your fruits 
and let's go to sell your apple let's do one apple oh that's not that's not d12 one apple so you can see that you are selling one apple for 0 0.016 busd yes please confirm and you can see that is credited into my account my my previous six or uh, my 959 is now worth 960 i can then sell my wheat again type in one because you have to put the amount that you'd like to sell you then press yes you then press confirm down the bottom and again you can see that i now have nine dollars 64 and then if i go to sell my strawberry um, which is the big dog 17 cents for one strawberry i click yes one okay press confirm and there we go it is credited into my account and i am now about 25 cents up uh within about <laughs> about an hour and a half two hours from when i did my previous collection so it is a really really good ecosystem and like i said it's very sustainable within within what they're doing i will have a video out at some point where i explain more about what they're doing as a company um because i think that that's very important however this is more of like a review of the bot um because i've been really impressed with what they're doing here um as well for anyone who doesn't know you can actually do collaborations so what by collaboration i mean that you can get people involved and in a sense that you get rewarded for that as well so as we can see the collaboration system program so for an executive farmer you get 10 at 10 percent for a lead granger you get three percent and a chief granger you get two percent so referrals are currently fixed but again you can you basically scale your community so you earn passive income based off getting people within the ecosystem and you get community bucks which is essentially this you can use it within the game you can use it you can withdraw it if you want to you can do whatever you want with that money and that is all yours to keep all you have to do is basically refer using your referral link if you want to press generate collaboration link right here um, and you can see that that is my referral link i will have a description in down below if you want to use my referral link because i think they'll be good to get people involved as well um so you can see if your account is inactive you will only get five percent rewards so that's why you want to stay active um, i believe that to, to have an active account what you need to do is you need to basically put a deposit into the account to showcase that you are active and you're actively within the ecosystem and then all you have to do is sit there wait collect farm and then sell your fruits to end with so ladies and gentlemen that is going to come off for the bot of farmlandia a very very impressive bot i'm so so impressed with it and i'm so excited to look at this more as well you know very exciting things coming up in the future and it definitely definitely something to have um have within your telegram because it's so easy to use and you can see that the withdrawal day so when, when you actually create an account as well just to add uh, the withdrawal day will be 15 days uh, from the initial uh, deposit so that is like sort of your lock period but could you call it a lock period because most staking sites you know you'd have it locked up for at least 30 days um so the fact that farmlandia is allowing you to withdraw it within 15 days and i'm sure as well you know you could probably ask the some of the team and they would probably do special requests as well they're very flexible because they have such a sustainable ecosystem and a sustainable business model behind them so definitely 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 something to check out and definitely something to look at investing in with that being said ladies and gentlemen thank you all for watching please remember i'm not a financial advisor do your own research do your own due diligence all that good stuff and with that being said ladies and gentlemen have a fantastic rest of your day and i'll see you next video on the channel take care everyone